before y'all come and say something about my cookabugs. You they about to get that. But it is, ho. Why did you order a long sleeve button up to go to the Bahamas? My breast laying next to the chicken breast. We ain't doing that. We ain't doing that. Tans back with another video like promised if you're new to my channel I hope I really do genuinely hope you enjoyed this video I hope I'm entertaining enough for you to join the small little family that I'm building here the small little community that I'm trying to gather but we're gonna get there today I have a get ready with me I know I promised a part two for the try on haul but this will kind of be like a half a half a try on haul slash get ready with me I'll be packing my bags for the trip getting all my essentials together, or at least trying to, so I can at least know what, what else I need to go grab. What, what else am I missing? Because I just need it to be a smooth selling, literally, a smooth selling. So let me grab my suitcases, show y'all what I got going, what I plan on packing, and then we'll start from there. So I just did a quick count of my outfits that I had to try on for you guys. I counted at least eight outfits. And that's alarming because I already tried on four for y'all. I'm going to be gone for four days. But I just feel like all of this is a necessity. I must take everything. I feel like I have to. Can I just tell y'all that I've just been sipping on this mimosa for breakfast. And it got me feeling a little cute. Yeah, just a little bit. Just a little bit, not too much. Let me get to this video. So this is what we looking like. I just, as you can see, I just threw everything. At first it was me, then my fiance started throwing stuff in here and vacuum sealing only half of the stuff. But we about to go through all of this, break it down, organize it. It's exciting, I'm, I can't. Let's just dump this out, I'ma just dump this out. Empty suitcase, it's time to make some shape. So I know, if y'all watched my first video, then y'all know what's in here. Most of what's in here. I'm gonna open it anyways because I need to show y'all some stuff that's in here. But I didn't show y'all. Yeah. Oh, I added some dresses too that I purchased from um where did I purchase this from? Pretty little thing that I never wore. Just so I could have options, I already mentioned that. I'm gonna be gone for four or five days, y'all, and I'm over here packing like, I have a week vacation. Okay, so what? We could do that. I did order me some bathing suits. I don't know if I'm gonna try those on. I don't know if I'm gonna be that comfortable. But it's super cute. This one came from Fashion Nova. I got it in a size medium. This is the bottom. This is the bottom to that piece. I love it. It came with a matching, I mean, it came with matching. It was supposed to be matching bottoms for the male for my mom's say, but they didn't have it. The second bathing suit I have is, pink is my favorite color if you haven't noticed, but this came with a three piece and I think it's super cute. This is the top, where's the bottom? Stop playing with you girl. Oh, here we go. Here's the bottoms for up. My favorite because your girl don't like her buns out like that. I really don't, so. I don't even know if I was showing y'all my whole arm away. Anyhow, this is the cover up for you. I love this. This is what I'm about to do because I'm causing confusion, not only for me, but for you all, I think. The stuff that you guys already saw me try on so that I can consolidate some of this stuff I don't wanna miss. But I'm gonna start packing and then we go go through a little list cause I need to make sure I have everything. I'm actually, Gonna put it back in the vacuum seal bag. Because if anybody use vacuum seal bags, you already know. You already know why I'm using it. I just need to sandwich everything. To sandwich everything, you know what I'm saying? I'm looking at one dress that I might not take. It's this one. When I first got it, I loved it. 
but it's so tight, it's so short. I'm gonna try this, let me just, this is it, this is she. I just feel like it's so, it's too short. I feel naked when I wear it. It has so much potential. <sighs> she might be staying here. She might be staying here. I'm not gonna feel comfortable wearing this. Nope. No. Mm -mm, nope. Nope. We're gonna change. Cause I'm not, I'm not, I'm not wearing this. Next one I have is this, the one from Pretty Little Thing. And I'm gonna show y'all exactly what I mean when I say that this, it, the, it's, if you can see, it's transparent. I can see straight clear through here, but let's see what they do. Let's see what they do. So this is the dress. It's all right when it's on. It has so much potential. Honestly, I love, I would love it so much if it was just a little bit thicker. It has some, some support here, considering that the bag is out. Like, I personally don't like for my, um, lady parts might to be showing. I don't know, I don't feel comfortable like that, so I have to get some covers. We can actually, we can do she, I like it. The first time I tried it on though, I absolutely hated it, like hated it. Because of the, it's just, mm -hmm. But this is from Pretty Little Thing, this is in a size medium. It's so old and it still has a tag on it. But yeah, this might be an option. I might just bring, just bring it. At the end of the day, it is comfortable. As long as ain't nobody seen a fruit cocktail, I'm good. Next one I have is this one, also from Pretty Little Thing. This one, I, I really don't have no complaints about. It's so cute. It's so cute. I'ma just show y'all. Have y'all ever. Look at me. I, it's, I struggled so hard to get in this dress. Oh my God, I was getting the attitude. I was getting the attitude, but this is it. This is, I love this. I ain't never felt comfortable like this before, but it's all out, but I actually don't mind it. Everything else is super covered up. I love this. The colors is popping. I was having like a green moment. I was just loving green. Like, especially emerald. But I like this. It's real classy. It's getting very classy. I think I'll do the captain dinner in this dress. I feel like I'm serving looks. They can serve me food while I serve books and what it is, ho. My hair, my hair is getting done the day before we leave, before y'all even, before y'all comment and say something about my cookabooks. They, <laughs> they, they about to get done. And then you can't tell me that. You know how I get, y'all know how I get. Next time y'all see me, shoo. Shoo, I might not know how to act. Shoo. But we cute, we love it. How do the wine glass look with it? How she look? Feel the dream? See, this is why this might be a problem. This is what I don't appreciate. All of my my fruit coming out. That's sacred. Out. That that hurt. That's sacred. I don't like all that showing. We gonna have to pin this here, body clip this because no ma'am. What I'm not gonna do is look down at my breasts on the table. My breasts laying next to the chicken breasts. We ain't doing that. <laughs> we ain't. We ain't doing that. But yeah, she cute. This is what we own. This is this is what we own. Next, y'all, this outfit is questionable. This is two piece. And I don't know how I feel. Because honestly, I didn't know that the texture was like this. A lot of things I didn't know about this, but that's okay. We're about to throw it on anyways. First time I tried this on, I didn't like it. And it's because it's too long. It's too long, but then I put my sandals on. And this is the back out I was telling you guys about. I love the back out. I was mad because I thought that it would be too loose around here, no support, but obviously the tighter you tighten it, the more support you have. It's super comfortable, I already know. I can see myself just scooping along and shit, eating my little ice cream, doing what I do, you know what I'm saying? Enjoying the sun. Yeah, very comfortable. I'm happy that I did get this. This, this came from one of my most recent orders. The latest order that I told y'all that I didn't like. This came from there. But I like it. Real cute. Let's get into these short outfits. I bought some shirts just in case. Y'all know how I be. Y'all know how I be needing a change. I got this pair. I hope it looks super cute. But this is a top that I got almost. 
Oh no, I got this when I went to Jamaica. That was probably what a, a year ago. I went to Jamaica, I got this and I didn't wear it as you can see. Tag still on it. But let me show y'all what we looking like. It's very cute. These shirts I had for hella long, probably like two years. I never wore them because I lost a ton of weight. I'm finally able to get back into my clothes and actually enjoy how they fit. These are Levi's. This is from Pretty Little Thing, if I'm not mistaken. Yep, it's from Pretty Little Thing. Still got the tag on it. And y'all know my famous prop, my cute little bag I got in Mexico. And I just threw on some um, MK sandals to kind of give a look. It was looking kind of basic with just the top and the shorts. And I'm trying to give y'all looks, I really am, but we do not do shoes on the carpet. And every time I do this, every time I do this, it makes me cringe. It really is, but this is cute. I super love this top. Here's this. When I first got it, I, I liked it, but I wasn't that happy. I felt like it felt too loose or something about it I didn't like. Truth be told, I think it was just having insecurities. I love myself so much more now that I feel I look good in everything. Like I'm not even upset about it. I'm not feeling self-conscious about it. I'm just loving myself. This is a cute little, little outfit. I don't know if I would wear this on the boat or off the boat. This is cut in, like this is like a cute little off the boat look, but I I, I didn't get all them cute old dresses from that. This would be a tragedy, y'all. I done packed all these outfits and ain't gonna know what to choose because I got too many options. That's the last thing I need on vacation. I have about, um. Probably like four or five pair of sandals on the brain and so like one or two pairs of heels for the dinners and that's, that's it. Maybe next, we got a real basic one because I really want to see how this look on me. I don't know if I'm like it. Super basic, just a crop top and some ripped shorts. Let's see what this look like. I ain't feeling it. I ain't feeling this one. I'm gonna love these shorts so bad. Like I love the rips, love the pocket out. And then at the same time, it's long in the back, you know, so you can see my um, crew cocktail. But at the same given time, I ain't got the derriere for these ones so right here. I ain't got the derriere. I don't know. I just feel like these are for people either with big old butts or Extremely little old butts. I don't know. This ain't it. This ain't attractive. I'm not. I'm not gonna do that to myself. I, I wish I would do that to myself. We gonna try some different shorts because this we ain't doing this. Honestly, it's just a no. It's just a no. It's too basic for me. I've just been dying to wear this top. I bought this top like a year ago, and I never got to wear it. And I wanted to wear it, but. Realistically, it don't even make sense to wear it anyway. Your girl gonna be hot, sweating this thick ass fabric from Zara. Cute top, great quality. Wish I could wear it. Jeans from Ross, they does the job. But this outfit ain't it. I like a child, and we grown. We ladies. One last outfit for you guys, and this one I really need y'all opinion on because I ordered this shirt for Fashion Nova. Was man when I got it, and I was just like tens years. Why did you order a long sleeve button net to go to the Bahamas? And I'm gonna make it make sense. And when I try to make it make sense, let me know if it made sense. You know what I'm saying? Cause I don't know either. I don't, but we gonna, let me show y'all what it's looking like. This is it, this is the last look y'all. And I kind of feel crazy just about this much. But then at the same time I don't, thought that I would be able to do a button up, half tuck in, half not look. No, look dumb. Look dumb, but this is, if we wear this, this is how we're gonna wear this. With this little top that I got from Fashion Nova, only thing that I have to complain about this top is this is how it was modeled. It's called the knot top. So I expect it to not, the knot to be like sold. It don't, you put it in yourself. But honestly, even without, we doing good. I like it, still without. I just wanted to add a splash of color. I just want color. But yeah, this may or may not be, and I'm a, this ain't, I'm not even gonna lie. It ain't gonna, this may or may not be a fit. This is gonna be a fit. And I wish somebody would tell me my long sleeves 
don't don't go right. Oh, hell. Okay, see that's cute. We still act kind of like that. We're doing something. But this is it. This is everything I just tried on. Everything that I will be taking with me, except the sandals. I got like four pair or five pair of sandals that I'll be packing in this suitcase. We're about to get all that together. We're about to get to this, get ready with me, get to packing these clothes. I think I'm gonna fold everything up off camera. I honestly, it ain't even that much to fold up off camera because I still have everything in. Yeah, so I'm gonna fold up. I just, I'll be all over the place. It's this, this is this of oh, you. I blame you. All right, let me fold up all the loose clothes off camera, have that all prepped so I can get the packing with you guys. So I'm packing on this vacation my red Tory Burch sandals, basic little MK sandals, my white Tory Burch braided sandals, some basic little guest sandal of my Givenchy slides. Of course, I need to clean them. Their yeah, white shoes are bad at <laughs> Some cute little Steve Madden bow heels and some more Steve Madden heels that go up the ankle from Miss Lola that I never ever got to wear. This bag, I don't know if I'm gonna pack it in here or if me and my fiance will be sharing a bag. Because if we're sharing a bag, this will highly likely be carried and he'll um, pack his slides. I actually think I'm gonna move some of these over here because why not we'll make more room. There we go. Now he has a side for his belongings. <laughs> But yeah, this is it, y'all. This I'm already packed. Now I just need to add my undergarments, panties, bras. Don't have to do that on camera. Paste, toothbrush, you know, essentials, lotions, and whatnot. But for now, I'm gonna close this up. All right, guys, that's all for today's video. I really hope you enjoyed vibing out with me today. If you're new here, please like, comment, and subscribe. Join my little family that I'm building here. Super excited for my YouTube channel and to see it grow and to share with everyone and to learn from others and to teach others. I'm just, I'm really thrilled about that just in general. I'm so ready to have a platform to speak to people, to reach people. Like I need this because we need this. I think, I think I'll be taking you guys with me, um, vlogging the whole vacation, meet some of my family, see what we getting into. If y'all not gonna get up and go see it, I need to, to show y'all, okay? Stop letting people stand in your way, even if it's yourself. If you wanna go on that vacation, go. If you wanna start that business, start it. If you want that new car, get it, as long as you can afford it. You know what I'm saying? Please take these chances. And if you need a little extra encouragement or motivation, I wrote a book called Manifesting the Life That You Deserve. I'll talk about manifesting, what it is, how to do it, the mindset to have behind it. And I'll also throw in a few, or it's not even a few, seven, yes, yeah, six to seven uh, manifestation methods to start your journey. Also, there's templates in the back to go ahead and start practicing those methods. So I'll see you guys next time for the vlog. It's gonna be a new me. Hair gonna be done. You ain't gonna be able to tell me much. I'll see you guys next time. Love you.